I forgot to do my video this morning, so I've already started the ride um, up to the caves. And I've done this ride before, but I didn't go see the caves because I thought I would be staying at the cave lodge. Anyhow, it's just a really cool little lookout place. And I'm standing on the porch of uh, one of the structures here. That's the porch I was just standing on. And it had this amazing lookout over where we just rode. And once you get to the entrance of the Lot Cave, they make you get a guide. So my guide is the little gal with the red hat, and they carry this really cool lantern. And at this point, you don't realize what the lantern's for, not understanding it's going to be pitch black without little lights. And if you look down into this little small river, there are all these big fish, and I don't really know the type of fish they are, but people throw fish food down there at them and they go crazy. It's pretty cool. And then you see the entrance to this amazing cavern. And as you're walking in, and you realize that there's very little light, the lights cast these cool shadows on the walls. It gives it a bit of an eerie, creepy feeling. But yet, yeah, you're surrounded by other people, so it's not scary. It's kind of fun. Then my guide starts pointing out certain shapes, like the columns, yes, and stalactites, stalagmites, but certain um, parts of the cavern are shaped like a turtle, uh, a Buddha, different objects. And it's really quite fascinating that that could happen. When you get to the stair portion, it's a bit challenging because the stairs are quite narrow. I mean, not narrow in terms of the width, but the actual steps are for tiny feet. Um, as you lead down into the caverns, there's some drawings, ancient drawings that you see. There's a sailboat. It's really interesting. As we started going back into the caverns on the return, there were some young men that were singing the tune or humming the tune to Jurassic Park. And it, <laughs> it was a bit creepy. <laughs> <laughs> 